Okay, so in this video, we are going to see how we can set our website team as well as how we can set a home page for our website. So you might be already remembering that a uh, website name can be set from under the configuration section. This was set during the installation process itself, but you may want to set it to something suitable or for some reason you may want to change it. Then what you can do is you can go to configuration system and basic site settings over here the site name you can change it to something so maybe you may want to call it drupal learning center or center can uh, provide a slogan slogan is a kind of a punchline that is associated with that so you could say best cms for the web but uh, the issue is that this slogan may or may not be displayed dependent upon the theme that we are using okay so this is there and the front page we can specify from here but for that we will have to create a page that has the contents that can be displayed over here similarly there is a section for error pages for access denied and page not found we can create these pages and these pages then can be used for the that purpose fine so let's first save this configuration and let's have a look what we are seeing so it says Drupal learning center this particular theme does not support the slogan as such so it's not getting displayed so we will see later on visibility of slogan when we work with themes now what we want to do is we want to display a home page over here instead of this default one so now what we are going to do is we are going to go to contents over here and we will add some content so here there are two content types one is article one is basic page we will be discussing about what is a content type later on but for the time being, uh, we will work with the basic page. These, as it says, use basic pages for static content like about us and all those pages where your content is not going to change much. We are going to use this. Fine. Simple pages you can make with this. So we will make one page with this. So it brings up the form. You can give the title over here. Welcome. And in the body, give some content that you want to use for the body part. So I have already copied some content from so this is some content and here there are some settings you can adjust it accordingly so like you can set it to bold then you can set something to italics and so on. Now there's an option of published we can save this and on this side there are some options which we will talk about later on so in the URL alias we'll simply put it as welcome okay so over here this is welcome so this will be the part to our page which will be like your website slash welcome and we will save this over here okay so our page is created you can see over here it is localhost slash welcome so we will use this particular information for our settings similarly if you wanted to create pages for the error page and this thing we can make that so what is a, a error page before we proceed let me show you if I type in something or someone tries to this thing it says the default page not found over here or if there is a section which is not accessible to a particular user it will give you the other access denied if you wanted different pages from them uh, for those rather than the default ones you can create pages and in the similar way you can do that so what we are going to do is first of all we will update our home page so let's go to configuration system basic site settings and here in this node we will put as welcome okay and we will save this configuration now when we go to our home page you can see your home page is ready 